Okay, welcome back to Dragon's Dogma, everyone. Now, we, you might notice that I'm in a different place than at the end of the last episode. Basically, I started recording and there was some glitch with my capture card and it froze. So, basically, nothing much happened. I came back to the town we started at and there was this small cutscene where we met that uh, creepy guy in the hood. And he basically said nothing important and he just fucked off. So I talked to this guy and apparently he saw something down this well. So I think it's time that we check this out. This is probably, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is a side quest. So I'm interested to see where this leads. Anyways, let's equip this lantern. What's this? And let's get moving. Okay, you guys just take all the we'll stuff. I know, I know. So yeah, you guys didn't miss much. I'm pretty sure I did gain a level. Didn't I? Yes, I did. Or was that before? I don't know. I might have gained a level on the way here. Now you, can, you can kill these guys for experience. And they die in one hit, so that's good. Anyways, let's go this way. The path splits, so there are two ways to go, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm level 6 now? That's good. These guys get quite a bit of experience. Uh, mushrooms, not sure I should be taking those. You never know what they might do. Okay, that's empty. Whoa, whoa, try not to fall off. So it looks like we have to go down here, maybe? Uh oh, my lantern's out. That's not good. Should probably get out of here. Okay, so it's a bad idea jumping in there. I think the reason for that is because I'm so short. Luckily, it's possible to jump around without going into the water. Okay, it looks like that's as far as we can go. Whoa. Let's check that map. And which way are we supposed to go? I don't think this leads to anywhere important. Doesn't look like it. Okay, wait, rat. Just get the experience. Okay, this is more like it. Damn bats. They do their quite a bit of damage, don't they? So I guess they're not all defenseless. A skull. I don't know. Would that be useful? This looks interesting. Oh, money? I'll take that. I don't know. It's 27 experience is quite a lot for especially for these guys. Okay. Let's thunder it. Slay the monsters. Okay. Ha. There we go. As long as I can keep it stunned, I should be fine. One. Okay, one down. Oh no, th he's not down. He's just... Did he faint or something? Oh, he's dead now. Kill him. God damn it, don't run away. Wait, no, no, no. No, don't go. Come, come. 
I don't want my guys to become too separated. As I think I, as long as I can keep them knocked down, I should be fine. It looks like my thunder spell does a lot more damage when these lizards are inside the water. Which would make sense. Uh oh, I'm nearly out of magic. Let's wait for this thing to recharge. You wouldn't think that magic would drain stamina, but I guess it does. Okay, we can just kill him like this. And Jane leveled up. Are there more of these guys? Okay. I think... Is that it? Oh no, it's not. Don't try to run away. I'll just shoot you. One more spell should do it. If it had a bit more range. Okay, level 7. Yes. Okay, well, that went pretty well. I thought that these guys would be a lot tougher. They look tough. God damn it. The stupid lantern. How the hell am I gonna get out of here? I guess we can climb up here, can't we? This looks interesting. Oh, right here. Yes. Come on, guys. Should probably get this lantern uh, lit again. Very well. Oh, are you serious? Am I out of oil or something? No, don't hold it. Wait. Unequip. Want lantern and use. There we go. Much better. So, let's get the hell out of here. Are you guys coming? Good. I'm level 7 now, so that's quite good. Mind your head. What? I don't think I'm going to bump into anything here. Doesn't look like I could, but thanks for the tip. And I think this is the way we came. There's nothing down there. We can speed up. Well, let's go. As I said, that went surprisingly well. Those lizards look quite tough, but I guess I guess they're weak to lightning. I assume they would be. Now, what does this guy have to say? You've slain the monsters of the well, have you? Yep. Truly, you are a wonder cousin. I couldn't figure this out. Is this guy actually my cousin, well, or does he just mind. call me the cousin? The danger to light. I take no credit, mine. I simply feared I'd be blamed for releasing monsters upon the village for having opened up the well. Well, I took care of that for you, didn't I? It is a relief, and all you're doing, cousin. Here. I owe you at least this much for all you've done. I shall strive to learn from your example. That's good. Commit myself to becoming a soldier fit to defend the land and its people. Honest. Okay. Well, as long as you're gonna do that. Masterfully done. Okay, so we got some money and we leveled up. And I think it's time to head back to the keep. Cause we have we gain a couple of levels. I think I have money now. What I'm probably gonna do is save my money, not gonna spend money on my pawns to get better equi equipment for them. I'm gonna wait until I get to a town where there's good stuff. Okay, let's check my map. Why are there two quests? Okay, there's that one and that one. Whatever. We'll check them out. We share these roads with traveling peddlers, guardsmen. I'm gonna try to avoid these goblins if I can. They're so incredibly weak that it's not even worth fighting them. At least I don't think it is. We can speed up here. Whoa. Watch out, man. Come on, guys. Can you keep up? 
I guess they can. Try not to bump into any of the merchants. Or travelers or whatever these guys are. Are you serious? I guess we can go. Jane could probably take care of them on her own, but whatever. Let's try Thunder on them. I never tried it. I guess it works pretty well. But they're, I think they're weak to fire. Yeah, they are. Uh, thanks dude, but I think we've taken care of them. Exactly. Well, for pawns, they're surprisingly talkative and opinionated. Let's get in here. Okay, so we can have a look around. Nope, not this. I want to check my map because... Huh, there's only one marker. I guess that shows... Oh, that shows the two entrances. I get it. So, I'm probably gonna not, not gonna have time to do this quest. So what I'm gonna do is spend some of those... Discipline points I got. Speak to him. Let's see, I'm probably gonna store some items that I don't need. I'm gonna keep the curatives around. Materials as well. Okay, where are all the like mushrooms and everything that I picked up? Oh, it's this. Well, I guess, whatever. I can keep these things around. Okay, never mind. Let's learn some skills. What is there left? There is Fire Boon and Thunder Boon. Levitate. That sounds good. Okay. Hmm. I guess we could go get Levitate. Sounds useful. I, g I don't really... I have most of these skills that I really really wanted, so I guess we can spend this. Yeah, go ahead. I'm guessing these are like skills that o activate automatically or something. Wait. So where can I set that? Or is it already set? I think it is because it... I mean, they're called core skills, so I assume they're, like, automated. Should I rest? Might as well. Yeah, stay till morning. So, yeah, I think that's gonna be the episode for today. Uh, okay. That's nice. Ah, uh, okay, is this what I got? Thanks. I brought this back for you. Oh, someone... Someone used Jane? I didn't know that. That's kind of cool. That's the first time that's ever happened to me. Huh. Okay. So, yeah, this is basically the online for Dragon's Dogma. Um, other players can use your pawns and then they gain experience and items and they can bring it back to you. So that's nice. I guess somebody liked the look of Jane. I like her look too. I think she's pretty cool. Oh, it's... Oh no, because I rested until morning, so... Yeah, the sun's just coming up. I was worried that it was just going down. I should just stop talking. I'm gonna end the episode here. So, thank you guys for watching. Next time we're going to be doing that quest. So yeah, please like this video and I'll see you guys next time.